Previously on Pokemon Emerald Random Nuzlocke Edition, Light sets off on his adventure, picking his first Pokemon out of the starter lineup, choosing Metagross. He ends up through Route 101 and ends up in the first town. And we're off to the adventure. So we got X-Boy, of course. Let's get out of here. And we just healed up. So, of course, let's talk to everybody real quick. I forgot about the wireless club upstairs. Yep, yep, it's all free. Let's go upstairs, see what happens. I never got to use these functions because I never had that cable on the GBA uh, or in the Game Boy. Didn't you need like that wireless link cable or something to trade with other people? I never actually had that. Or the wireless adapter. I guess they did have that as well. I never had that. All right, let's talk to this lady. Work at the Pokemon. Can I get you to come with me? Well, she didn't give me an option. She's just kidnapping me. All right, Pokeballs. Yep, yep. Oh, you know what? Don't give me a, a potion. I need a, a Poke, Pokeball. What am I going to do? I can't harm any of the Pokemon without killing them right now with that exploit. He has no weak moves. Um, how much money? I got 3,000. Oh, they don't even... Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. It's been a minute since I did this. Oh, what the hell? I thought I could buy a... Maybe I... Oh, you know what? I have to do a tutorial for catchy, don't I? Before I'm able to buy it. Yep, she just said that I can't buy Pokeballs. I should have talked to her first. All right, well, let's go off on an adventure. Where do we go from here? I guess we could just check out all the houses. Like I said, it's been a while since I played this, so might as well re-search everything. Yep, yep, they level up. I remember you could also go to the TV and watch random shows, and I don't know why I, I sat there and watched it as a kid, just thinking there was going to be something new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He won't let me go past that, I remember. What's this old lady want? Alright, so this is just a really extended tutorial, of course. They're telling you how Pokemon work, how the battles work. Blah, blah, blah. Come on now, where is... Where is my tutorial for catching a Pokemon? Oh my god. Arbok. A level 2 Arbok. What do you think about that? Come on, X-Boy. Don't be scared of this. I want to see how much damage I take. This might be dumb, but I'm going to see how much damage I take with uh, takedown. Three. About three HP. Okay. Not too bad. And I leveled him up. Though I really don't want to keep leveling him up too early because I don't know if I can catch another Pokemon. You know, since I can't hit them without them dying. Alright, this is what? Route 103. There's May. Oh, God. So we got Arbux here. I guess that's going to be in my team then. Instead of Ekans, I'm going to jump straight to Arbok. Which is Cobra backwards. I know every single person in the world knows that, but... You know what? It took me a long time to learn things as a kid. And I was really happy when I found that out. Anyway, do I have to battle her here? Or does she just... i uh, give you a Pokeball. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of being the trainers like... I remember as a kid, I thought it was so unfair that she wouldn't let me heal my Pokemon. I mean, I guess that's what the potion tutorial was for. She got a Torchic. Come on now. You can't beat X-Boy. I'm just going to kill it with Metal Claw. Oh, you know what? I should have checked Confusion, because Confusion might do um, low enough damage. Oh, I just realized I didn't kill her. It might do low enough damage to normal Pokemon. Well, when I say normal, I mean the wild Pokemon to not be able to die right away. And then I can catch it. So anyway, let's kill their Torchic. I wish they had to play Nuzlocke too, so I just murdered her Torchic. Weak. Weak, May. Just like in the anime. 
And I got to steal her lunch money as well. I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, but it already likes you. You might be able to befriend any kind of Pokemon easily. I don't befriend Pokemon. I enslave them. Well, it's time to head back to the lab. I just got here. It's only my third day out here. Alright, well, let's go back to the lab, I guess. You know what, just to be safe, I'm gonna heal my guys. I gotta be extra careful on Nuzlocke, right? I also decided, because, especially because I started with such a strong Pokemon, I decided I'm not going to overlevel, because I could technically just get around the Nuzlocke by sitting there and grinding until I'm level like 90. But I'm going to play it a little risky. I'm going to add some, you know, some niceness to this playthrough, I guess. I'm trying, I'm trying. I need the running shoes. I think I get them right after this. I think I got to go back to the lab think they'll give me pokeballs or do I still have to wait till I go and catch that Ralph with some with some random kid I did May has an extensive history as a trainer already damn she sucks how long has she been training she can't even fight her torchic is level five come on now here light I ordered this for my research but I think you should have this pokedex dope it's a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokemon you meet or catch. My kid May goes everywhere with it. She's got one Pokemon. You got a failure of a daughter, my guy. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records its state in the Pokedex, why, May looks for me while I'm out, doing field work, and shows me. Oh wow, Light, you got a Pokedex too. That's great, just like me. I've got some for you too. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. I'm gonna look all over the place. All right. So I can only catch Pokemon like the first one that I see starting from now, now that I have Pokeballs. I can only catch the first Pokemon in each area, right? That's gonna be confusing for me because I have horrible memory. So I might have to like rewatch my own videos to see um, uh, what areas I've already caught. I, also, I just realized the mod randomizes where all of these Pokemon spawn, but does it tell you where the new areas are? Let's see. Oh, well, it's a, it's technically a starter, right? It's not going to tell me anything. Let's see Zigzagoon. Because it shouldn't be in the areas that, like area one or whatever. It shouldn't be there because that's where it originally was. And it's no longer there. It shouldn't be at least. Uh, cool, so I think it does update it because it's showing Zigzagoon all the way up there. That's definitely not correct. So how do I look at my map? Do I not get a map? I really need, I really want a map. I really don't remember how to... Okay, whatever. Mom, you gonna give me some shoes? I did actually mod it, or I did it on the randomizer mod. I made sure that I could use running shoes inside because that's just... Um, a life hack. Oh, what an adorable Pokemon. Adorable? It's fucking terrifying. Father's child, alright? You look good together with Pokemon. Here, you're going to wear these running shoes. They'll put a zip in your step. Bet. Press the B button. Mm-hmm. Your father will be overjoyed. Please be careful. If anything happens, you can come home. Alright, alright. I'm good. Hey, there we go. Look at my boy. Fucking Usain Bolt over here. Alright, now I can catch stuff, right? How many Pokeballs do I have? Did they just give me one? Five. Okay. Alright, so this will count for sure. I am in area Route 101, which means that I need to catch the first Pokemon I see, or I cannot catch one here. So, here we go. My one and only chance. Oh my god, a Cacnea. Alright, bet. I'm gonna be really, really, really safe here. And I'm just gonna try to catch it without damaging it. And let's hope that it catches it. If it doesn't, I don't really know what I can do. I just started overpowered. Please, please, please. Ah! Oh, sweet! I got my boy Cacnea! Alright. 
Cacnea live in deserts with virtually no rainfall. It battles by swinging its thick spiked arms. Once a year, a yellow flower blooms. And then it dies right away, I guess. Yes, I have to nickname it. Um, You know what? I'm going to call him... I'm going to call him... Rob. We got X-Boy and Rob now. Yes, look at my boy Rob. He's got Sand Veil, Ups Evasion in a Sandstorm. He's naughty nature. Boy, Rob is naughty. He's got Poison Sting, Leer. Oh man, I just realized the older school Pokemon doesn't let you um, uh, level up everybody. Oh, I gotta be really careful then when I level this up. I'm going to switch him, and then I'm going to switch him back out, because I think x -Boy can take a hit. I'm going to be really sad if x -Boy dies, just because I didn't plan this correctly. Alright, another Cacnea at least. Another level 2 Cacnea. Do I take the, the risk? Mm, no, I don't want to take the risk. Come on, x -Boy. I just want to give some XP to Rob. I want to get him out of the level twos at least. I want to get him up to at least level five, and then uh, and then I can start using. I missed. Oh hell no, dude. He can't even hurt me. All right, metal claw him. Rip his face off. Sweet. It does it always raise the attack? How did X boy not level up? Or I'm sorry, how did Rob not level up? Come on. All right, we're gonna be safe and just. I, actually, I don't think they need it. I guess I can do this for the PB. Also, if you guys are watching, let me know in the comments a good nickname for the next Pokemon I catch. I will go ahead and use it. Alright, so I have used Route 101 already. Caught one. Oh, this guy's done. Finished sketching it. Oh, he's an idiot. It was his own footprints. Alright, so I can catch one on Route 102 then. And I'm just gonna go ahead and not fight this guy. I wanna catch him. Let's see. Let's see what we get. Potentially. Oh, a Bell Sprout. This seems like a good starter Pokemon. Hey, I just realized. What about fishing spots? Does that count in Nuzlocke? I've never... I guess it's one per area, so I, if, I guess in the future I would have to pick whether I want to fish or whether I want to uh, find one in the grass, right? Um, I'm going to shift just in case because I feel like Rob can die pretty easily from a level 4. I think x -Boy can take a couple hits with his high defense. Yeah, that's fine. So let's try first throwing a Pokeball and hoping that it catches. Please, please, please. Sweet! This is this common? I don't remember how easy it was to catch things. Alright, so now we got a Bellsprout as well. We're filling up the team pretty quickly. Bellsprout's thin and flexible body lets it bend and sway to avoid any attack, however strong it may be. From its mouth, it leaks a fluid that melts even iron. Well, that's ironic because it was fighting a, a pretty much a steel Pokemon. Alright, yes. I kind of want to call him, uh, hmm. You know what? Let's just go simple. Let's just call him Yella. Because of the yellow head. Does that guy not want to fight or what? Hey, stop making me move, bro. Ah, oh, damn it. He won't let me talk to him. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Oh, I, I kind of would have preferred this. Well, it's too late now. All right, Rob, you got to get some XP, so we're going to shift again. We got to get at Rob and Yella to at least level 5. X-Boys is going to level up because he's sort of the main guy. Damn, nothing affects me. This guy is too OP for early game. All right, Metal Claw him. Rip his face off. Dead boy. No more rats in my house. When is Rob going to level up? God damn it. Here we go. Alright, let's check actually the stats for yellow because we didn't really check it. 
Grass Poison, of course. Chlorophyll. Raises Speed and Sunshine. It's a Brave. It's got Vine Whip, and that is it. And that is it. No item. Okay. Not a bad team, huh? huh? I got a Grass, a Steel Psychic, and a Grass Poison. So, I'm gonna get annihilated when I go to the Fire Gym. Alright, so I did Route 101, I did Route 102. I don't really feel like fighting that guy just yet. Let's heal up. Oh, there's a rule on like how many times he can heal or something too, right? But I'm not going to use those rules. Maybe later in game, if it ends up being way too easy, I'll start incorporating harder rules for the Nuzlocke. But for now, we shall do justice. All right, and what is up here? Route 103. All right, let's catch something in Route 103. Nothing wants to... Here we go. Oh, right. It's Arbok. I do want an Arbok on my team, and I guess I really don't have a choice anyway, so... Let's, again, switch out for X-Boy just in case. Damn, bro. Pokeball is his dude. Mmm. I was afraid of that. I might not get me a 103 Pokemon. Well, I don't want to get too hurt. We'll try one more, and then we'll try harming him, but I don't think I'm going to be able to harm him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, sweet! I got me an Arbok. Uh, let's see. This Pokemon has a terror, terror, terrifically, terrifically strong constriction. Ugh. Jesus, I can't read today. Terrifically strong constricting power. It can even flatten steel oil drums. Once it wraps its body around its foe, escaping is impossible. Yes, I'm gonna call him. Actually, what what do I call him? Or her. Let's do Liz. Cause it's like lizard. They're not really a lizard, I guess, but you know what I mean. Cool. We got four of the six main Pokemon already. Oh man, I got too many of the same thing though. I got poison, grass poison, and then grass. So Oh well. Uh heals the body by shedding. Shed skin. Okay, calm. Uh, eight, 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 eight. Lots of eights. Wrap, leer, poison sting, and bite. So it's like the better version of Rob. Rob and Liz. What else could I potential? Does he want to fight? Oh no, he's the same guy. What else can I get from this? This is like the only thing in the area or what? All right, Rob, this battle, you better level up. I ain't got time for for your silliness. Because we still got to level up Liz, too. You can't harm me. I got a clear body. I don't know what clear body means. I guess clean body, right? Like clear of toxins. Oh, and it's a critical hit. Finally. Thank God, Rob. And X-Boy leveled up too. Sweet. All right, let's get out of Route 103. We've caught everything there. Um, So 101, 102, and 103, we're done with. 100%. And we caught everything that we saw there, which is good. Because now we have four Pokemon. Two more, we got a full team, and we can start leveling them up a little bit. All right, let's go. Um, let's buy some Pokeballs. I think I can buy Pokeballs now, right? Yes. We got to buy them bulk. And the Premier Ball. Oh, wait. You know what? I probably need some of these stuff, too, just because of 
the fact that it's a Nuzlocke. And we have to be a lot more careful than usual. Usually, I don't even use items, to be honest with you. I just don't like wasting a turn on using an item. But I feel like it's pretty important here. There we go. I'm broke. I gotta go steal some lunch money from kids. Alright. So, I know somebody out here wants to fight this guy. Come oh, wait. If we're gonna fight... I should probably... Well, I don't know what levels any of these trainers are. I'm gonna just bring him out, because I know he's not gonna lose. Oh god. Look at this little kid. He looks way too angry. Puchiyena. Puchiyena. However you say that. It's a level 5, so I should probably be leveling up to about level 5 then. We'll try Metal Claw on him. That should get him pretty low, if not one hit. Yep, one hit. Alright. Listen, if you're strong, you should have told that me that before. Bro, you're the one who attacked me. No, you know what? I want to level up my Pokemon to level 5 before I start fighting. Because I want them to at least be able to take a hit, so I can level them up easier. I'm also curious what else is in this grass. Another bell sprout, okay. Rob, do you think you can handle it? Poison sting it. Oh wait, that's not gonna be, because it's a grass poison. Oh. You can do it, bro. I believe in you. Yes! Um, another one. Come on, man. You don't need X-Boy to help you out of your... Uh, what does Leer do? I don't know. It lowers something. It's just not useful. Come on, Poison Sting him. Alright, alright. That's enough playing around, right? Let's bring out X-Boy and end this. I kind of wanted to finish him off with just Rob, but Rob wasn't getting the job done. Failed. He failed his Pokemon trainer, his master. Oh man, this is going to take years. I forgot how much grinding there was in this game. Alright, let's go heal. Let's go heal Rob. He, he can probably take on the Route 101 Pokemon, right? So let's just go there. I really hope I don't get hit with like a critical hit and then I lose an entire Pokemon this early, but we'll have to mourn him, of course. We'll we'll cry for a good 10, 20 seconds. No, I don't want you again. No, no, no. All right, Rue 101. Come on, Rob. Don't fail me now. Don't fail me now. Metapod. I kind of want a Metapod, though. I know, it's like the most boring Pokemon, but still, kind of do want it, not gonna lie. Well, at least I poisoned him. Let's see how much damage he can do. Oh, he just hardens all the time, doesn't he? And then uses like Leer or something. But poison doesn't care about defense, right? It's, it's a static damage to health. So I think I should be able to bring... Uh, bring him down. Oh no, he shed it. God dang it. Why are you shedding skin, bro? It's so weird. I mean, I'll be able to get him, but it's just with the defense raising, it's going to be really annoying over time. But there is a max amount you can do, right? You can't harden until you're, like, invincible. I'm fairly certain there's a cap. Finally, there we go. Alright, one more, one or two more turns and I should be good. Yeah, one or two more. God, Rob, you suck. Alright, here we go. Good job, buddy. Uh, no, 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 he didn't get hurt. Let's just keep going. I was more thinking about the PP. The power points? What does that stand for?
What the hell is a Diglett doing here? Oh, accuracy. That's one that actually really annoyed me. I never cared about stat changes too much, but that is definitely one that bothered me. All right, so this is going to be another grind. I'm going to miss like 90%, and then he's probably going to one-hit KO me somehow. Use Dig or something. Poison last... Oh. Okay, two. I'm good, I'm good. Let's say critical hit does what? 200% damage something? So it would do four, maybe? It's double as effective, right? Damn, he's lowering my accuracy. He's blinding the hell out of me. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Don't, 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 don't. He's got the weakest poison stings of all time. This Diglett does not care. Rob, don't miss now. We're so close. I don't want Rob to die, of course, but I think he deserves a little bit of pain because he is. He needs to learn quick. Come on, bro. You're missing everything. I'm so glad that it's poisoned or this would have taken like a year. All right. Here we go. Level five. You're good now, Rob. You're done. And it finally learned something else. Nice. What does absorb again? It just steals life, basically, right? Yeah. Attack absorbs half the damage inflicted. Yep, yep, yep. I remember. All right, so now, Yellow, you got to get one more level higher. So let's bring you out. Another Diglett? Okay. Show me what you can do, Yellow. Please be better than Rob. Fine whip him. Oh, that is awesome. You got a little more in your yellow. Well, it's not going to be super effective against Metapod, but I mean, Metapod can't really do anything except Harden, so... I think we're good. I think we're safe. It's more about how long this is going to take. <laughs> oh, no. Vine whip him to death. The more he hardens, though, I'm literally doing like one damage. I know, I know, I know. I could just switch automate this quicker, but then I'd have to do another battle. I feel like this battle, him fighting alone, or she, her fighting alone, will uh, will make this, you know, take one battle for, for her to level up. So, come on, Yella. I believe in you. I'm almost out of PP, I just realized. It's on the bright yellow. It's okay. This Metapod doesn't know what's coming. Another Vine Whip is what's coming. I might actually run out of PV before I can do anything. Finally, it reached its cap. There we go. I should be able to do it with two, so I'm good. This bro, bro turned into like a... Like a Metal Pod. <laughs> That is not funny at all. Good job, Yellow. I wish I would learn another move, though, but we'll save that for later. Lose. You're the last one. And I actually don't trust a level two. Unless it's a Metapod, I'm going to switch it out. Mm-mm, mm-mm. You're not fighting a level three Cacnea. I just really don't trust. I don't trust this Arbok lady. X-Boy, you come out. Metagross doesn't have a gender, I just realized. I'm curious how much confusion does. <laughs> it probably won't hit. Yeah, it still won't hit. There we go. Now I can trust you a little bit more. Once we get... 
her to level five, I think we'll do a, a stop there. All right, let's, um, do I try it? Let's try it. It's not very effective, right? It's not very effective. A critical hit. Oh God. Yo, if I can actually wrap and poison it, then Cacnea will be dead in no time. Why are you leering me? All right, poison sting should end it. That's right. Now I'm trusting Liz a little bit more. One more battle will be level four. So I think maybe four more battles and I'm good. Would it be cheating if I speed this up? Poison sting it for sure. I sped it up a little bit. I don't know if it's noticeable. I don't think it sped it up at all, actually. I changed the... I changed the emulation fast forward speed. But I don't think that does anything. Alright, well, whatever. Level 4. It'll probably mess with the music anyway, so I guess it's better that I don't speed it up. Oh, you're, you're fine, Metapod. You're about to die right here. Poison sting it. Maybe even bite it. Yeah, I might just bite it, actually. Let's bite this dude. That's right. You can harden all you want. I'm still going to chew you up. So it probably needs this battle and one more. And then I'm done, right? Oh, 30. Yeah, one more. And then my team will be level 5 and above. Come on, Kecnia. Bite it. I don't know why I bit it when I could have used poison this thing. Poison sting it. Oh, it didn't kill it. I, I don't know why I thought it was going to. Oh man, if I got poisoned. Because I remember every step you take in the overworld, you lose one HP or something like that, right? If you're poisoned. There we go. Two attack. Cool. So now look at this team right here. Look at this beautiful team. We got Liz at level 5. We got X-Boy at level 7. Rob at level 5. And Yella at level 5. Wee! Yes, we're going to heal. And we're going to end our adventure today at nearly the same place we were before. Though this time we have a lot more Pokemon. So... Yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Of course, we're going to catch up with you guys again fairly shortly on episode three. And of course, if you like this series or if you have any suggestions on how to make it better, always leave that in the comments. Um, and hopefully you're enjoying the ride so far. So, yeah, I will catch you guys in the next one.